name is Melody Ben, and welcome to A New Generation. Today I'm going to be talking about plastic, one of the most destructive things to our environment. Plastic pollution is the worst. Humans use plastic every day. We use plastic so much that the average American uses 185 pounds of plastic a year. And that's one human. There's about 7 billion people in this earth. Imagine if everybody used 185 pounds of plastic a year. And one pound is about three medium sized bananas. Imagine 185 of those. That's a lot of plastic. Soon, there'll be more plastic in the ocean than fish. Imagine that. There's a place called the Great Pacific Garbage Patch, which is made of complete trash, hence the name. It is twice the size of Texas and three times the size of France. It's crazy. And also, do you know what the Mariana Trench is? Well, if you don't, it's the deepest place in the ocean. To be precise, it's about 36,200 feet down. Well, you wouldn't think that a plastic bag could get 36,200 feet down. Well, unfortunately, it did. Humans found a plastic bag that far down. It's absolutely terrible. Humans are slowly destroying our oceans. We need to help save our planet. Plastic kills so many animals every single day. You know, they get stuck in it. The poor things eat it. And you know, there's a reason that turtles eat plastic bags, because they look like jellyfish. Try to tell the difference. I don't blame the turtles. I can barely tell the difference. You know, we've got to do something or most of our animals will die because of humans. Your plastic bag that was at the bottom of the Mariana Trench. It could have been your plastic bag that killed a poor innocent turtle. We've got to do something about this. Instead of throwing away your lids that you get from coffee cups, draw a picture on them with a Sharpie or something that will stay on. And then, watch this. You get a torch, you get your lid, and you shine it, and it will make your image along the wall. Perfect for sleepovers. Also, you know, you don't just have to use the lid. What about the actual cup part? Well, you can stick an image you like on it or draw on it. Put your pens in it, stick it down, and you have a lovely pen and pencil holder. Perfect for school. Also, there are alternatives. You don't just have to make things. For instance, instead of using a plastic bag, use something that will disintegrate quicker. For instance, a paper bag. And don't just throw it away as soon as you get it. We store our paper bags and we've had this one for about a year or so. And you can use the same one every time. Also, if you do have to use a plastic bag, don't just throw it away. We've had this plastic bag. It looks like this is from England and I moved there three years ago. So we've had this plastic bag for about three years. Just keep them and then you can go into a shop and say, instead of giving me a plastic bag, do you mind loading up this one? And also, reusable bags. This is mine from Halloween. Who cares if you go into a shop with a Halloween bag? At least you're not hurting the wildlife. Just load up your shopping in here. It's much easier. And instead of getting a toothbrush, get a bamboo toothbrush. You can get them on Amazon really cheap. Me and my brother used our bamboo to toothbrushes and we still have them. You don't have to just throw away the plastic ones. Or at least get a decent toothbrush that you won't have to throw away lots. I'm a turtle, so like and subscribe for me. Good turtle. Let's help save our Earth.
step by step. Let's create a new generation. Yay! A better generation. Like and subscribe.